Is Mahoning County's treasurer taking too long to cast checks on property tax payments? It's the first attack in what could become a heated campaign heading into November, and Ohio's primary is still two weeks away. 27 First News reporter Jerry Ricciuti spoke with both the challenger and the incumbent about the process of getting those tax checks into the bank. As people line up to pay their half-year Mahoning County property taxes, the woman who'd like to become the county's next treasurer was kicking off her campaign for the November election. The office is not uh, being run efficiently or with expediency. Canfield businesswoman Christine Oliver, who's running as a Republican, claims Democratic incumbent Dan Yemma isn't depositing tax checks quickly enough. The Ohio Revised Code mandates that those checks be cashed within one business day, and that's clearly not being done. Oliver says taxpayers are complaining it takes weeks for their checks to clear their banks. She cites a section of the code she claims requires the deposits be made. Our review indicates the treasurer must account for each day's receipts, as well as notifying the county auditor about what's been received and deposited. But it doesn't appear to specify timelines for making those deposits. We deposit checks immediately upon processing. We, we, during tax collection, we, we deposit two to three times a day. Yemma tells me the processing of those payments usually takes seven to ten days, adding it used to take weeks before new scanning equipment was purchased last year. He says there are more than 160,000 parcels that are taxed in the county, and each bill has to be opened, sorted, and categorized by hand. Thousands on a daily basis, and, it, and it's just physically um, impossible to touch every one of those every single day. Yemma tells me those who pay their taxes online can have their accounts credited within a couple days in most cases. In the meantime, Oliver says she plans to run full time through Election Day. This is what I want to do as, as my career. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.